The Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office has their equipment ready should Erica move this way. News Channel 8's Rod Carter continues our team coverage in Tampa. Hey, good evening. We're off Spruce Street at one of three locations the city of Tampa has set up for people to come out and get sandbags. I'll tell you what, the guys who are working this have been doing this a lot. They've been doing it a lot over the past few months because we've been dealing with a lot of flooding in this area. They're not the only ones, though. Call this Bay Area flooding a few weeks ago a bit of a dress rehearsal for Erica. We have rebar cutters, we have Dremels. A lot of this stuff is multifaceted. Hillsborough County Sheriff's Deputy Chris McCurtry was in the middle of all of that in this very well stocked vehicle. And this main area is where we have um, a lot of our tools. He is a part of the Sheriff's CERT team, which stands for Special Incident Response Team. When storms occur, they cut out the wait times by being ready and in place at a moment's notice. So in case we actually have to do a rescue and uh, and the fire department is not available and we're first on scene, we can actually begin a rescue if needed. Today, they wanted to show off the truck, these big mobile command rigs as well, even these F-150s that can plow right through floods with ease. Not to brag, but to show that the Bay Area, should Erica bear down, is ready. All of our specialty equipment is readied uh, and uh, prepared to deploy should the need arise. And again, sandbags are available here at this location on Spruce Street. Also, two other locations throughout the city of Tampa and several locations throughout Hillsborough County as well. We put all of this information, everything you need to know in preparation for Erica on our website, WFLA.com. Now back to you.